YouTube. So we just got Jeff in the tree and I figured I would explain what we're doing today. One of our uh, usual customers just bought this place and um, apparently this was the owner of another local tree service around here and I guess he passed away like four months ago or something. Um, the homeowner now that bought it says that this stob, you know, they used for like practicing, maybe training like new, you know, maybe training like new climbers or something. But it's not gonna work for reselling. So right now Jeff's up there and we're bringing this thing down. Hopefully it didn't hurt you guys on the first first job back with a new GoPro. See when you're doing these kind of jobs, when I was rolling the rounds out, I was thinking about how I was rolling the rounds out. And I rolled them out in a way that would help build like a little gate here. So if they do roll, it protects that kind of stuff that already has a little bit of decay and busting the bark off of these little fruit trees. So, when I'm moving things like that, I'm trying to move them in a specific way. So, it's not only clearing is opening, but it's also protecting us and protecting, um, you know, lessening the chances of hitting people's property and stuff. Nice job, Jeff. Thanks. I was like, you looked like the most perfect tree cutter ever <laughs> up there. I hear that all the time. I, no. Dang it. Jeff got this thing down with flying colors. Now we're just gonna move a little bit of wood and uh, he'll fall stem right through there. We do have the telephone line or power drop to worry about, but it's been shortened up quite a bit. If you fill it right towards the power line, it would definitely knock it out. But if you go kind of parallel, it'll be perfect. It'll be perfectly parallel. <laughs>
<laughs> Getting a little wild, Jeff. You got me nervous on camera. Yeah. Can't even pour gas straight. <laughs> Don't spill. Don't overflow oh, it. Oh boy. Oh. I like it at 100. Yeah, come on. <laughs> <laughs> I like it at 100. When it does this. Yeah. Like it when Sometimes it... you can burp it. Yeah. Mm. Burp. The 200 is burp. Not the 500s. The Jeffries burp too. <laughs> yeah. me and Jeff are all finished up with our uh, first job this is kind of just like a day in the life type thing it's nothing super epic but it's just what we're doing today we were just listening to some kind of country song that says I'm feeling lucky today <laughs> and that is how I'm feeling I'm working with Jeff over here Jeff went up slayed that fir tree first stop you know I get to record it and our next job is pretty cool too. There's one little kind of puzzly log that's hung up. Um, more puzzly for the homeowner than for us, really. We'll, we'll go up and I kind of already have a plan for it. <clears throat> I'll show you that. And then we've got two dead pine trees. I'll be climbing one and Jeff will be climbing the other. Unless Jeff's trying to steal my content, of course. And he's wanting to take both of the trees. So uh, we're going to go get... I'm gonna get a coffee and Jeff's gonna get a quad shot. You gotta and then, grab your hard hat too, right? Yeah, I gotta grab my hard <laughs> hat too. <laughs> I grabbed all my gear and left my hard hat on the back of the Chevy. So uh, we gotta swing by the yard. Well, we're gonna swing right by the yard anyway, so I'll just stop by there and grab it. So uh, <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna grab coffee and a quad shot. We're gonna get the quad shot for Jeff because he's tired. He is so tired after that first job. Um, I had to put my hands down and let him step on my hand in order to get into the truck. <laughs> As like a little like lifter. <laughs> Just kidding. He bounced in like a beast. All right, that's our plan. Show you the next job in a sec. Ooh, orange light. <laughs> Just turn red. <laughs> All right, we got a little chips, so we don't want to stop too fast. 